What is going on guys, it's Dornir and I've been getting the question so many times lately Why do we use maces or which drag war is the best? So I thought I will make a quick fit showing you guys how the drag war works or like how dual wielding works in general And I know the Smoky made a video like this but people still don't seem to understand it So let's go I'll set up a dummy first Alright, no, we get a me, okay Alright, so let's take for example this ability, it's called Dismember and it dismembers your target dealing 125% weapon damage over 6 seconds. So if I would use it, it's gonna deal 125% weapon damage, so let's see what happens. Alright, it hit it 200 and it keeps 200, hitting 200 each time. Now let's wear the Dragor Maces. Now the Dragor Maces have less weapon damage. But the speed is higher, meaning that even though you can use abilities uh, every 2 seconds, it doesn't mean that you have nothing on the speed, because the speed is also calculated in when you use an ability, so it calculates the weapon damage as well. So let's use this member now again, and as you can see it's doing 200 damage again, even though if I equip, de-equip my offhand, it still is going to do the 200 damage because dual wielding at the moment is broken and it only accounts takes in account the main hand weapon damage for most of the abilities, not all, because like Massacre and I believe these other ones as well, Fluid and Destroy, do take the weapon damage in accountant for both weapons because that's how they work, but for abilities like Assault, um, Severe and the other ones, it only takes the main hand weapon damage meaning that dual wielding is broken and it's gonna be fixed soon hopefully right as you can see I just did another dismember and it's doing 200 damage like the weapon damage and I'm only wielding my main hand so it's no difference at all with the offhand so the real question is now which one has the most DPS and like I said they calculate the speed and the weapon damage when you use an ability meaning that they all have the same DPS so let's use Assault now, so this is 600, 1700, 1500 and 1400. Right, so let's use now the Dragon Longswords and don't forget it doesn't always do the same damage because it always varies like you still have a bit luck involved but if I would use Assault now again it's gonna hit the similar or maybe less or maybe more because that's still how EUC works, it doesn't take fully the uh, weapon damage always. Alright, so let's use Assault again. 1300, 2000, 500, and 1100. It should be the same around. So there's really no difference at all when you use the normal abilities. But let's see what happens if I use Massacre. So I'm going to use Massacre now. And that's 1257 bleeding damage because that's how Massacre works, it uh, uses 150% of both your weapons and if I will use maces, it does hit less so that thing is also a bit broken, it doesn't take account the speed of your weapon which makes the maces a bit less useful but that's only for the Massacre ability so let's see what happens if I use Massacre again and Massacre always hits the same bleeding, ability, bleeding damage like the 1200 it always hits the same because it's based on your weapon damage and it sticks to that. Alright, so also we can use Slaughter. Alright, so it's 902, 192, and that's like the lowest you can hit with Slaughter. And if I would use the Drago Longsword, it can hit that as well. But it can also hit a bit higher, but same goes with Maces. Alright, so let's see if Mas okay, Massacre is back. Let's use Massacre now. As you can see, it's 2007 bleeding damage because the Dragon Maces have a bit less weapon damage and uh, the Massacre doesn't take the weapon speed into account, which is broken also. But for other builds, like I said, if you use Assault, it does take the main hand weapon damage and it combines with the speed of your weapon, making them equal so they do the same DPS. Like, there's no real difference between the long swords, rapiers, and maces, except that the maces have the 9 prey bonus, which I found useful to use, and that's why I pretty much always use 
the maze is for. Now you can combine a main hand maze with the off hand longsword to do extra more damage with massacre. And I'm not sure about these flurry and destroy, but they do by but they do seem to do the same damage as well. So that kind of sums it up. All the weapons have pretty much the same DPS except for with Massacre. But I think that has to get fixed because it should use take uh, the speed of your weapon in account as well. And the maces have the 9 prey bonus, just the main hand though, not the off hand. Which makes the main hand mace a pretty good weapon to use for everywhere. And the only real other difference is that their slash... Uh, rapier stab and the weapon maces are cursed but that doesn't really matter because if you're fighting a boss or monster who's weak against that style it means you will hit a bit more accurate but with the uh, drag weapons being 5k accuracy each is a lot of accuracy and you hardly miss so that doesn't really mean a lot at all it doesn't mean that uh, you'll hit better on kk just more accurate but you already hit every single time so it doesn't really matter at all Except for Slay, like you can hit uh, with Slay also a bit more accurate on the Slay monsters. But that's it guys, hope you are informed a bit. If you have any questions, be sure to leave them in the comments. And hopefully dual building is getting fixed soon, because it's pretty annoying that it's been like this since the EUC beta. And yeah, see ya.